Okay, here we go. Booze House Towers back again with another little Whack Yourself Wednesday. Hope everyone is uh, well and good. Enjoy the old uh, lovely weather. Got a bit of the old uh, sniffles at the moment. The old uh, hay fever has uh, struck. But if we uh, take a bit of a few meds, uh, get that away. Anyway, me uh, chatting absolute nonsense about um, allergies. Anyway, back to the booze. Um, didn't do this lot. Well, didn't do one last week. Um, just got carried away with time and whatnot. But I saved it for this week. Um, and I'm going to, well, kept in the fridge for a whole week on the chill literally just popped out of the fridge so I'm going to give it a go so what I've gone for is the old uh, Four Pure um, Citrus Double IPA Punching Tropical picked this up from the old uh, Asda I forget that there on the old uh, sign so this is, comes in at 8.3 but I'm just thinking actually is this just really just the uh, the old uh, juice box remember that Four Pure used to do but obviously since the old uh, rebranding they've uh, Obviously ditched the name and just gone with a Citrus Double IPA as I'm pretty sure that was a Citrus Double IPA as well um, coming at 8.4 but I need to obviously uh, crack this open because it might be like a new little recipe or something like that um, let's give this a little while mm. lovely also went to see uh, LCD sound system last night down at uh, Brixton Academy doing like seven night or six nights down there should go and see them still a few tickets left uh, best time I've seen LCD absolutely fantastic also it's my birthday so it was a, a lovely little birthday treat so let's uh, get this into the little glass gone for a little uh, shorty today little one third as I've uh, got football later on and this uh, does pack a punch at 8.3 uh, looking pretty decent there, the old uh, poor and the old colour. Bit of a head there, but that's uh, probably my uh, ship roaring. But that's uh, evaporating pretty quickly. It smells uh, smells pretty juicy, pretty citrusy. Oh. That is a lovely little drop, very fruity and tropical. Doesn't taste like 8.3. It's, not, it's been quite a while since I've had the juice box, which I mentioned earlier, but tastes slightly different. But maybe I had a juice box on draft rather than the old uh, in a can. But yeah, it looks like they've tweaked that recipe slightly from uh, before, from my, from my memory, if it serves me right. But that's a, a lovely little drop. And I'd say that's pretty dangerous as it comes in at 8.3. It doesn't taste like 8.3 at all. Or maybe you're getting like. Could get away with like a five, maybe if you just want to have a guess. Finger in the air with that, um, with that level on the old body of the tongue and whatnot. But yeah, as again, as a juice box, I used to like that down the boozer. I think they used to serve it down the Victoria Tavern um, in a lot like Holloway way. Um, so used to have that quite a lot there. Um, as yeah, Phil Pure done with the old Switch Double IPA onto another winner there again. And so yeah, hats off to Phil Pure. That seems to be your uh, repertoire, the old uh, double R IPA with a little bit of citrus twist on top and the old punch. Anyway, this is me out. Um, go outside, enjoy the weather, get some uh, double IPAs up, up here and uh, loads of booze. <laughs> See ya, bye.